Madayao, Davao City. Today's adventure is set in no other than the King City of the South, the City of Davao. As the largest city in the country, Davao City is home to many of the country's most famous attractions and home of the Philippine Eagle, which is why Davao earned its nickname, the Crown Jewel of Mindanao. Join us today as we hear stories told by the Dabaweños of life, love, and beauty. This is Imagine Philippines, Davao City. They say that in order to truly know a place, one must immerse himself in its history and culture. Jerry Saltz once said that museums are wormholes to other worlds, which is why our first stop is in Museo Dabaweño, a museum with the creation of artifacts dedicated to showcasing Davao's cultural heritage and history. Let's revisit the history of Davao City in 50 objects. Thanks to museums like Museo Dabaweño, the legacy of those who came before will live on, to be marveled upon and to learn from, for the generations to come. We're now here at the Malagos Garden, a 12-hectare theme park which houses the country's first chocolate museum. It's not only picture-taking and sightseeing though, because the chocolate museum is where you can learn all about the craft of making cacao and ultimately, chocolate. Malagos Garden also hosts a magnificent bird farm. Here, visitors are treated with an opportunity to get an up-close and personal experience with the different bird breeds. Early mornings here in Malagos Garden Resort, we also have a bird watching activity. So, uh, na encourage po namin ang aming mga bisita na mag bird watching. We have free binoculars that they can use para naman po makapag spot ng birds in the wild. We also have a trained bird guide as well to guide them all over the resort. The oldest kanina tatla is Toby, so Toby is already 26 years old. So aside from the Malagos chocolate, we are also known for our Malagos cheeses. So our Malagos cheeses are made from Anglo Nubian goat's milk. Po. Ayan, so over here we have the Victoria Crown pigeon. That is the biggest pigeon in the world. Po. So here in Malagos Garden Resort, we also have what we call the Blue Deck Cafe. So dito po namin sineserve ang mga a la carte orders and of course our plated lunch and our plated snacks. So Malagos has always been firm believers of the farm to table movement. So of course we have a wide array of menu mostly that comes from our gardens as well. So uh, first off we have over here the Malagos chocolate kumba. So it's a pork kumba with our signature Malagos chocolate. So talagang binabalik-balikan po talaga dito ito no na menu. And of course, this is also proudly Davao as well. And ito naman po is, uh, we have the beef caldereta. We have the, uh, on top of that is the Malagos queso puti. So as what I've mentioned kanina, we also have Malagos cheese. So baka gusto niyo po itry, ma'am. Uh, so this is our Malagos farmhouse salad. So uh, Malagos Garden Resort also have our own hydroponics garden. So we grow our own lettuce and our herbs. So uh, mostly made up of our own uh, plants naman po itong Malagos Farm. So uh, I'm inviting everybody, uh, please, uh, when you go here in Malagos Garden Resort, also try our View Deck Cafe and our wide array of menu that is proudly farm to table as well. And perhaps the highlight of the Malagos Garden Tour, the Chocolate Museum. This experience is not only enjoyable, it is also informative. 
Learn about the industry and trade of the chocolates we so love to indulge in. Three to four experience po siya because uh, sinishare po namin ang aming process from the tree itself to making it into a fine flavored chocolate. In the chocolate industry, we have what we call single origin chocolates and three to bar chocolates. So three to bar chocolates, yun po sila yung mga chocolate makers. Na from the tree itself, hina harvest po namin yung mga prutas, kinukuha po namin yung beans, and then we we process it in the farm until ma punta po siya sa mga chocolate uh, making company uh, para maging fine flavored chocolate. Single origin chocolate naman po is what we call chocolates na I isang lugar lang po talaga siya uh, hinarvest at ginawang chocolate. So, both of that you can call Malagos Chocolate. First up, we visit a Davao Classic, a bakery cafe called Ani Pai. Um, originally, the business um, Ani Pai was a convenience store slash bakery um, located sa ano sa isang village dito sa Davao na Pachera and then we transition um yun yung business ng parents ko they opened 1987 mga ganun. and then um, through the years nag nag change na yung ano na yung business and then pumasok na kami uh, ako and then my husband and then we transitioned uh, into a bakery na talaga we wanted to focus on a bakery so kami ng husband ko we used the name we used the name Anipay to create this business into a uh, bakery cafe yeah. Anipay came from the combination of their names yes ng kapatid uh -huh. Anipay. Anipay is Andrea siya me is Nicolas brother younger brother niya then Pai is the younger Actually, ano, um, yung Anipay, we focused or um, yung main product namin is the cinnamon rolls. Yun talaga ang aming uh, signature flagship product. product. Yes, flagship product namin. Although, marami rin kami other products such as um, and, cookies, oh, oh, bar cookies, mga brownies, and sensory bun, you know, chocolate cakes. Yan. Pero yung aming flagship product is our uh, cinnamon rolls, yun yung um, pasalubong na ano, from Davao, mga ganon. Tapos we also have many flavors of cinnamon rolls. Bali, homey talaga yung ambiance na yun. Relaxing yung ambiance na parang cozy. Homey na ambiance. Yun yung aming gina, ginagawa na general feel ng aming stores. So we cho choose yung mga warm colors, light na ano. Plants. Lots of plants, light plants. We just transitioned during the pandemic to light plants. We used to have plastic plants para less yung maintenance. Tapos yung 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 kinakapture talaga na parang pag pumunta ka ng aring pali, you feel at home. It's uh, just to compare, no? Uh, para siyang ang naging template namin is parang Mary Grace. Yun yung feel. Similar to the plant. Nothing screams Davao Cuisine more than a unique durian-flavored coffee. And that's just what our next stop brings to the table. Meet Blue Grey Cafe. Hi everyone, I'm here today at Blue Grey Coffee here in Matina Town Square, Davao. So today, we're going to try their famous durian coffee chino. I think I'm saying that right, durian coffee chino. So I'm personally I'm a fan of durian. It's one of the best. You can have durian shake, uh, durian ice cream, and now durian coffee. So let's check it out and see how it tastes like. All right. Wow. Initial thoughts. I didn't know coffee and durian can go well, go well together. When you first take your, when you take the first sip, you can feel a durian pulp. Um, as you taste that first sip of coffee. And it tastes so good. The, the flavor of the coffee and the durian mix so well. And the aroma of the coffee and durian go well together. Um, you pair that with the chocolate tart. 
Uh, they say it's the best seller here at Blue Grape. It's your go-to spot for an after lunch or an after dinner. Just get some um, desserts and amazing durian coffee. So I invite everyone to please check out Blue Grape Coffee here at Batina Town Square. Dava. Seafood has always been a food staple here in Davao. Our next stop is in Hilltop Crabs, a place that makes sure you don't miss out on any of Davao's finest seafood dishes. Hi everyone, we're here today at Hilltop Crabs Buffet in Tulip Drive, Davao City. Now, if you're a fan for seafood, this is the place to go in Davao. So, uh, what, Audrey, what do they have for us today? Right now, we have the crabs. We also have shrimp and some scallops. So as you can see, the nice thing about this place is that it's unlimited. So unlimited crabs, unlimited shrimp, unlimited scallops. And unlimited rice. Unlimited rice. <laughs> the, the most important thing here. So let's, we're gonna do a short taste testing and we'll let you know how it, you know, how good it is. All right. Ah, nagsimula po kami noong 2017 tapos uh, nagkaroon po kami ng maraming branches. Uh, all over Mindanao usually meron tayong mga Jetsan, Hidapawan, Tago. Tapos dito sa Davao meron tayong four branches. Tapos sa Manila din meron tayo sa Mandaluyo. Ah, yung bestseller talaga namin yung crabs po talaga yung buttered garlic crabs namin na binabalikan ng mga tao. Tapos may shrimp style and scallops. Tapos we have unlimited sanggipsal as well. Kasi hindi masyado ganun karaming stores yung unlimited crabs dito sa Davao. And medyo pricey din yung crabs and seafoods. Tapos unlimited pa tayo. So, medyo uh, marami talaga tayong fans sa uh, unlimited seafood. At sa tingin ko naman, um, nagiging seafood capital na siya ng, ano, ng Mindanao kasi dahil sa lumalaking stores natin, dumadaming stores natin. And thankful talaga ako and patuloy po tayong nagsuserve ng magandang seafood, magandang quality and service para sa Davao and sa nation. If love and warmth was a place, it would be this city. We learn today of Davao's beauty through its history, people, and nature. While that may be all the adventure we could fit in a day, we'll unravel more reasons to fall in love with Davao in our next episode as we continue exploring the city. Join us next week as we start discovering more of Davao through the Kadayawan Festival and many more. This, this is Imagine, Imagine Philippines, Philippines Davao City. Davao city.